Hey guys, it's me Ronald from Technic Box and the Samsung Galaxy Note 4 is here and Samsung has announced it yesterday. Here's the Samsung Galaxy Note 4. Here's the picture of the phone and the S Pen itself. Here are some more pictures of Samsung Galaxy Note 4. More colors and more angles. And let's get on to the software specifications. It runs Android 4.4 KitKat and it has a Samsung StatchWiz UI on top of Android KitKat which looks something like this which is displayed on the screen right now. If you guys don't like TouchWiz it may be a deal breaker but Samsung has done a great job with those TouchWiz user interface and it has new features like um, power gestures and more it's really great and let's move on to the hardware it's running an 8 core ARM processor at 1900 MHz and it, it also has a quad core variant which is running at about 2.7 GHz okay here is the RAM it has a 3 gig RAM and that's really good for a phone like this it has 64 GB built in and support for micro SD, micro SDIC, and micro SDXC cards and up to 64 gigs. That's a real good feature. It has a battery of 3220 mAh, and that's I think that's not enough for a phone like this with a huge display and beastly powers. The display of it is a multi-touch display and it's a 5.7 inch display. It has a resolution of 1440 into 2560 pixels and with a pixel density of 515 ppi. That is a great pixel density and you can see any of the pixels with your naked eye. It's really great and the technology used for this screen is Super AMOLED uh, technology by Samsung. It also has a proximity sensor which is used for hover gestures and it's a scratch resistant screen which is really good feature and moving to the camera it has a 16 megapixel camera with dual LED flash it can record uh, videos up to videos up to 3840 into 2160 that's 4k video at 30 fps and it can record 1080p videos at 60 fps it has a 3.7 megapixel front facing camera and on the connectivity side you have USB connectivity, NFC, Bluetooth and Wi-Fi connectivity. Those are great and everything works really well. You, you also have 4G LTE support which is also a great feature. And the sensors on this device include accelerometer, gyroscope, compass, hull sensor, fingerprint ID gesture and a barometer those can fulfill all the needs and it can also uh, be so helpful on your daily life and that's it guys that's about it thanks for watching see you in the next video subscribe to my channel for more i will be doing more and more videos like this and like my videos help me support me that's it guys thanks for watching subscribe as i have said bye see you in the next video